Hey, welcome back to Five Lakes Garage, and today we're back on the 2006 Mazda 3. Now we're here today to actually do something very simple, very easy, just like usual. It's always easy, it's always simple, mostly because I got a co-pilot here. I got Ray, that's actually going to be doing all the work. So what we have here is a just a generic Bluetooth adapter. This is a 2006, so the radio does not come with one. It does come with a six disc changer. We're going to disconnect that because we don't need it anymore. He uses CDs. Now we're doing Bluetooth. Uh, it also has hands-free, so we have a little microphone that we're going to have to shimmy up the side. Uh, do be careful because of the uh, airbag that's over there. Disconnect your battery first. And then we're going to be able to find a good spot for this guy behind the dash. So, what are we going to need? Well, there's a couple things. We're going to need a Phillips head screwdriver and a couple little plastic pry bars. So, I'm going to hand this over to Ray. She's going to do it for me. All right. <clears throat> so, here's the radio. This little plastic right here needs to come off. So, what we're going to do is actually take, take your little tool, probably that guy first and you already broke it i know i already broke it anyway we're gonna pry this up a little bit so we can get the other tool in and it's just a couple clips so it's a clip a clip a clip and then this one down here is a little uh don't pull out pull that way go ahead and get that off okay i can try i don't think this is gonna work though all right. just all right. all right come in from this side because if you do it here this is weak this is stronger so we want to make sure that we get be nice when my tool didn't break. We might have to go right there. There we go. All right. I so I'm going to lift this up. Well, you were prime from here. We're going to slide it over. Okay. All right, get your other tool ready. Actually, I was I'm going to lift this up, and then she's going to get the bigger tool right behind it. Okay. All right. So you're going to go this way, and then pull out just slightly. Wow. My I worry about filming. All right. So while she's doing that, just a little bit of pressure over here. I'm gonna break it. Mm -hmm. There you go. One more. There you go. And then you should be able to pull it right out. See, this is the little part that I told you to go back the other way. So we have a clip, a clip, a clip, and a clip. So notice in the back. We don't want to ding it up. All right, so we want to get the radio out. So there's one screw here and one screw there. All right, we're going to put them down here in the cup holder because we do not want to lose them. All okay. right, so basically this entire thing is going to come out. Now you're going to use your little tool. Use this guy again because what you want to do is lift up your air vents so that it will slide out. You're sliding this out? Hold this. Here, you hold this up. Okay. Alright. There we go. Just pull the whole thing. Don't do it too far. Alright. So the whole thing just pulls right out. Alright. Now, when you look on the back of it, you have your radio antenna. You have all your speaker outputs. And then right over here is the plug that we're going to need. He brought this out, it's all tangled. All right, so that plug there fits right back here. All right, so, all right, just leave it right there. All right, so we just hooked it up on the back of the radio. As you can see, we just have it out here because we wanted to test it. Use my microphone, just called Reese, Everything seems to be fine. We got music going across. Sorry you can't hear it because pff, copyrights. You know how that is. But, oh, I got something. There you go. Now we're watching one of, one of our videos. All right, so everything seems to be working fantastic. I do like this little unit. Uh, now all we have to do now is wi uh, route some wires. We need to throw a wire all the way to the other side for the microphone or put it up here. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure something out and kind of go from there so once we figure that out we'll bring you along let you know all right right where you want to put it 
Oh, hello there. Thanks for watching. And if you really like it, go ahead and hit subscribe. If you really like it, go ahead and hit the like button. And go ahead and comment because I want to hear what you have to say. Could be good, could be bad. I don't know. Let me know. And if you really want to send anything to the channel, help us out, whichever. Here's a P.O. box that we opened up in case you want to send something. I'll do a video and see what it is. Have fun. Enjoy the rest of the show. All right, so we got all the wires routed where we want everything to be. Now, first thing would be your microphone. We stuck it right there. Now, we were going to put it all the way up here into the top, but that should be just fine. If that actually has a problem with audio or anything like that, we could just move it. You got plenty of cable. All we did was actually just tie wrap it up out of the way. Now, this uh, connection here would be our auxiliary. What we did was actually just poke the hole right into the glove box and we'll just have this curled up inside. Now I did pull it out so we can see what was behind it because obviously you don't want to drill in through other wires because then you just have more problems. So everything is on there. It does come with, on this particular one, it comes with a USB stick. Now you can put some MB3 files on this thing and then just, it will be in the back of it. Play it as many as you want. All it is is uh, going to look at like maybe CD1 to CD2, whatever. Um, we don't use <laughs> we don't use MP3s anymore, so we're not going to hook that up. So this unit's been around for a while, but hey, so is the car. So anyway, what we're going to do now is tuck this all inside so that it doesn't move around, it doesn't get messed up. Now, one thing I would love to do is actually have a some double-sided tape to be able to put this thing in there but it didn't come with it and i don't have any there hold this thank you all right so we're just gonna tuck this guy back in here all right make sure all the other wires are tucked in that we're not gonna pinch them or anything like that let's see if we can get this guy in there do you want to or your back no okay All right, radio is in. Now let's give it a quick whirly do. Yep, that's word. All right, should sync up to my phone. What did I do with my phone? Oh. Ray stole it. Hey, welcome back to Five Lakes Garage, and today we're actually gonna cook a pizza. Yep, cooking a pizza. Not anymore. But really? <laughs> he cut me off. <laughs> yeah, I don't like to listen to myself either. Uh, all right, so what we're going to do now, uh, your microphone is in. This is I hooked up. We have our uh, MP3, just in case if we ever need it. We're just going to tuck all this back in there. It's just got a couple clips, a couple screws, done. And then uh, we'll be right back in about two seconds. All right, everything is up. We don't need the key on right now. There we go. All right, so let's grab our piece of plastic and this guy's gonna go in just like it came out. So tuck this in first. I just got fingerprints all over it. Oopsie. Bam, look at that. Looks factory. Oh my gosh. Now, did we break anything? I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> you hope so. That's not. All right, I gotta turn it back on. All right. So in order to get this thing to work, uh, obviously you have FM. Uh-oh. <laughs> All right, we don't have satellite radio, but we do have CD. CD is for EX. Now. Hey, I learned new stuff. Uh, thanks to one yeah, we can watch a video. Switch. I'm gonna pick, take the name and wow, there goes the name. Okay. <laughs> all right so that was just one quick way of getting this car one step closer of actually driving it properly uh we're gonna go take her to work so that uh, she can earn some money to buy more parts to put more stuff into her car so stay tuned for some other stuff we got some windshield wiper stuff uh some painting some what else we got here not money no, not money. Oh, we're going to redo our headlights because they, they, they're kind of chalky. They, they look bad. So we're going to redo that and I think all the other stuff and get it lined up. Other than that, I think we're in good shape. So anyway, keep watching. 
keep doing it yourself and yeah we'll catch you next time later he just broke my car <laughs> it's old it's gonna happen it's fine you're old but we don't <laughs> whenever you break we don't say oh it's gonna happen you're just old yeah you do that's not the point <laughs> all right where do you want to put this though